Hey guys, this is Panda here. And first of all, I'd like to apologize for not putting out a Dead by Daylight video in quite a while. It's been over a week. Um, and I just wanted to make this video to have a talk with you guys. Uh, I wanted to ask you, how are your matches going in Dead by Daylight ever since um, the skill-based matchmaking was released back in, uh, I believe, August? August or September is when this was released, and I remember I was freaking out about the system and how I wasn't, you know, I wasn't really excited for it. Um, but now that it's been out for a while now, and we kind of get how it works, uh, my question to anyone that ever watches my vids is, what do you guys think of the new system? Has it been a better or worse experience for you? Like, I know a lot, I see a lot of people say a lot of negative things about uh, the SBM sbmm uh, on twitter and, and reddit and stuff like that but uh, i just wanted to get some other opinions if you guys uh care to share your experience with the game so far um i'll tell you mine um uh right off the bat uh survivor cues were or survivor games excuse me survivor games were a lot better in general i mean i still had games every now and then where you know, I'd probably yell at the survivors because they weren't doing gens or whatever, but um, for the most part, I felt like my games just had better survivors in general, and we were uh, playing really well, and, and, you know, usually getting escapes, I wouldn't say like all the time, but like a decent amount, whereas before the skill-based matchmaking, I would mainly die a lot and, and not have really great games. Um, so I think in that regard, Survivor is a lot more fun. I do find myself playing Survivor a little bit more often these days, uh, just because of um, the increase of quality of, of the Survivor games, in my opinion. Uh, Killer's side, the first thing I want to say about Killer is that I am super disappointed that winning as any killer improves your MMR for the other killers, but even if it's a small amount, I don't think that's right. For the reasons that I stated before. Um, like, just because I'm winning with, uh, let's say, a huntress or a nurse. Whoa, what happened to my... No network connection. I guess we'll just stare at this... No oh, you guys can't see the, the connection error, but... Um, I don't know what happened. Maybe my internet died for a sec? Yeah, it did, actually. But I'm able to record this video because I'm not streaming. Um, anyways, sorry, um, back on topic. Uh, killer games, I don't think other killers you're not playing as should be earning MMR. For example, if I win with, like, I love playing Huntress a lot, and I understand if I have a higher MMR with her, but that does not mean I should get a higher MMR with a skiller that I am not good, uh, a, a killer that I'm not good at with at all, like, Ghostface, for example, is probably one of my worst killers, and, um, Maybe Hillbilly. Like, they, those killers play differently and should not be gaining any MMR whatsoever. And another thing that's kind of deterred me from, from playing a bit was... I guess I haven't really seen it in my games. It's just the fact that I've seen it being posted a lot. And I see it a lot on YouTube and Twitch. But a lot of the streamers that I watch have been getting hackers. And... I We haven't really seen much of a response from Behavior on how they're going to... Kind of counter all these cheaters and hackers in Dead by Daylight. And then we have also the other side of the spectrum with uh, the high ranked killers going against like all these tryhard survivors that are bringing the same perks and the same add-ons and maybe some mean map offerings. Like uh, my MMR for killer, I don't know where it's at, obviously, since we don't know how to actually like look at the number. Uh, but I'm, <laughs> I'm honestly just happy where I'm at. Uh, I'm in no rush to get to a higher MMR. I'm just playing games, you know, win or lose, whatever. I'm still giving people hatch occasionally if they were nice survivors. Um, things like that. Um, and I know I haven't really been uploading like I mentioned earlier. Sorry about that. But with the new update, 5.3, just coming out around the corner this Tuesday, in fact, um, I'll be more than happy to upload some new... Uh, some new content, probably some more killer videos since there's going to be a lot of new add-ons to try um, and a lot of new balance changes to just try in general as well and I'm very excited for those. The changes to a lot of killers are enough to 
to make them fun and interesting to play against. Not overpowered, because that's never fun. We don't want just like broken OP, like every killer to be broken OP, but definitely just more different play styles and, and variety when it comes to playing certain killers would be great. Um, that being said, uh, once again, let me know how you guys have been enjoying the new system. You know, have you been playing more or less often, or did you quit entirely? Things like that. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Uh, thanks again for watching. Look forward to more DVD content once that new update drops. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye-bye.